what is going on YouTube is your boy Billy Kibaki and today I'll show you how to download install and play games on your PS3 using the new PS3 exploit hand now it's very simple guys so let's go ahead and get started also keep in mind that this is a part 2 video of part 1 so we're gonna continue from right where we left off from part 1 and in part one video remember that if you remember we don't we make a dump of the act IDPS that's the that's the first thing we did in the part one video so on your USB stick you should have those files now so remember that we did copy over these files on the USB and we don't need these files anymore you should have this file that says act dot or act alone and you should have your IDPS X if the IDPS if your IDPS X file does not say X and it says bin instead go ahead and just rename it to X instead of bin once again if this says bin IDPS bin go ahead and rename it like this also this should say hack dot and it is not saying it right now so let's go ahead and fix this file all you have to do is go to view right here then go all the way over to file name extension and it should says act dot now so let's go and delete these files because we don't need them make sure that you don't delete these two off your USB stick so we delete those and what we need to do now with these files is that we need to create a new folder and you can call it whatever you want but I'll call mine this okay so let's drag these two files in there now let's copy this and let's paste it somewhere right here this is the hand ps3 folder that I created in part one video so I'll paste it right here just to make it more easier now on your USB stick you can go ahead and delete this file this folder okay so what we need today now we're not going to use the hand supports file like the last time so we don't need that file so what we're going to do we're going to use this one the resigner and we're going to need a game that we're going to try out first so to get those to get the resigner and to get the game let's go over to Google and you will need the PS3 exploit resigner just click right here and it will start to download I'll leave the link in the description for for this tool so to get a game go over to psndl.net I'll leave the link in the description as well click on package in the search bar you want to type PSN click search and I'm, I'm gonna try this small game because it's very easy to download and very easy to transfer to the USB stick so just click on that game and click download package it's gonna start downloading right there and then you need download wrap this is the wrap file the wrap file is what we're going to use to activate the game so just download the wrap file as well so after you got the after you have got your resigner tool and you got your ps3 game that you want to try out first let's go back over to the hand folder right here so let's go ahead and extract the resigner tool extract here and inside the the dump the act IDPS dump you want to copy your two files go back out and you want to go inside the resigner and you want to go inside riff gen master now paste okay that's it now let's go back out and we're gonna go and get the game and the wrap file so go inside the game folder that you have and just copy both of them and go inside your resigner folder the rift gen master 
and you want to paste it right here perfect everything is going good so far so what you need to do first you need to sign your PKG first so you can right click and you'll see it says PKG at the end so drag it and drop it right on the Rift Gen Master here drop right here just drag it and drop it right here and that's it at the bottom you can see it says PKG signed so just close this now you're gonna end up with two folders two files now two of the same file but one just says PKG and the other say PKG underscore signed dot PKG this is the one that we need the one that says sign so just cut this one and paste it on your USB stick okay once it's done you want to rename this you want to just you're gonna rename it but you're gonna just take this the underscore signed dot pkg off so click rename click right there make sure that you don't mess anything up so pay attention what you're doing and you just want to delete these now let's check perfect okay so now we need to sign the wrap file if you right click on it you will see it says wrap file this is what we're going this is the license for the for the game you need a license to activate the game and you need a license for every one of these games that that's on the website so just drag the game and drop it right on the rift gen as well and that's it it's done as you can see the top one says wrap wrap and the bottom one says riff and now you have seen that it says writing sign underscore act that it's done so press o press enter two times and now you will have two of the same file but one is wrap file and the other one is riff file so cut the riff file and paste it on your USB stick that's it now if you look down here you will see that we have one more file that's called sign act dot now this is your your account um, I would say account data and the riff file was signed to it so now we need to cut this one and put it on your USB stick as well now let's rename it as uh, as well and we're gonna rename it but we're just gonna take underscore sign that's it that's all we need what we need to do right now is plug your USB stick inside your PS3 so let's go ahead and do that okay so let's bring up the PS3 now and wait let me just minimize this back yeah so in the in part one of the video you saw when I went to the um, the exploit page and run everything from the exploit page but today I won't run it from the exploit page because it takes a little bit too long to get it up and running so I'll run it of mini web and I will leave these the, the config file in the description as well because mini web is a lot faster because you're running the f you're running the program locally so everything works a lot faster so th the first thing you want to do is make sure that you disable your antivirus because your antivirus will block the mini web from running so make sure that you disable your antivirus like for an hour okay and on your mini web you want to right click go to properties compatibility and run as administrator 
now double click and open it up and you will see your IP address my IP address is this but yours is gonna say something different so let's go over to the PS3 now and we're gonna just we're gonna type the IP address in so go to your internet browser And remember you should have a blank page from part one and you want to press triangle and you just want to delete your history right there now press start and you're gonna delete this right here then you're gonna type the IP address the same exact way that it shows right here now I have mine in the prediction so that's mine right there let me bring it up and show you for a second as you can see that's the IP address and the IP address here as well so let's go and press start and you will get this page you're gonna get this page so what we need to do right now is that we need to activate um, hand first we need to do this first to activate this first so go ahead and activate hand enabler first now go down to right here press X and that's it now press enable and and that's it a lot faster guys now after we have enabled hand what we need to do is go and install our game and we need to go to install package file and go down to standard press X and you will see your game right here now press X and it's gonna install it okay so the game is complete installing so what we need to do right now is that we need to go up back to our internet browser and we need to copy over that riff file that we just created and we need to copy back over the act that that was signed as well we need to copy those two files over the riff file is what's gonna unlock the the game to the account that we have so let's go ahead inside this folder the the browser sorry go inside your browser and you wanna make sure that miniweb is still up and running and you wanna go and type your IP address again in press start when you get to this page go up to act act riff copier so press X and this is where it gets a little bit tricky now guys so right here in this box where you see these where there's a lot of X we need to we need to type the the riff file number in this box and we need to type it the same exact way now let me show you let me show you this is the this is the the riff number it's saying wrap wrap right now but it's the same number when it when it convert to a riff it's gonna have the same number only a different name at the end so the wrap number is still the same number as the riff number so I need to type this inside the box that says that has the X all the X so type it the same way 
and also keep in mind that if you see these that looks like um, O it's not an O it's actually zero so you'll see like two zero right here and some people might think it's an O but it's not an O it's actually zero so if you come across any circle in the riff number it's zero not O okay so let's go back here and we're gonna type we're gonna delete delete all the X's only leave dot riff and make sure that you type in caps and I did have the file the numbers in um, predictions so I'll, it's easy for me my riff number is a little bit easy but other riff number is gonna ha have different and it might be a little bit harder so go down and press initialize act riff and it says hand copy or initialize successfully so press copy now and this will copy the files from the USB to the PS3 and there you go I got confirmation to close the browser okay so now that we just copied over the the signed act that and we copied the riff over as well all we need to do right now is just restart the console only once the developer says that we need to restart the console once with the signed act file and then the, all the other riff for the games we can just install we can copy over those on their own without using a signed act file again so let's go ahead and restart the console okay so let's go and where is it oh it's right here what we need to do right now is make sure that miniweb is still running and we need to go back and enable HAN so now that you're back on your browser so press start delete this and type the IP address from the miniweb again press start and we just need to go over to hand enabler and let's click right here and initialize and enabler we got we got a success enable hand boom and that's it really fast using the mini web guys now let's go and try the game out and that's it it's as simple and easy as that guys as long as you follow these steps and you'll have no problem so that's it guys thanks for watching please like and share and when you see that like button underneath the video guys hit the like button please so in the next video guys I'll show you guys how to run um, unassigned games unassigned games are games that were like um, converted in PKG but they have no license keys those those are just um, signed install and play nothing more to it no we don't need any riff file or anything like that so thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in my next video